everyone. So I've had to really raise my tripod to fit all of this in. Hang on a second, move you a little bit. So this is a little bit of an Im another impromptu video because yesterday while I was out, I was walking past a shoe shop and outside they had all these bags. And one of them, which I will show now, caught my eye because it really reminded me of the Delphonics bags. Not, I mean, it's not exactly the same, but with all the compartments and everything, when I saw it, I thought that's a great alternative and it was only 12 99 So we went inside and had a look to see what others they had. And they had this one. Now, as you can see, I've had to just lie it on its back for now. So yeah, things are gonna fall out. But um, I just wanted you to see the front of it because yeah, because it's obviously I've had to just raise the tripod and everything and try and fit all this in. So this would probably be about the size of the largest Delphonics bags. The bag that I saw is smaller than this, but this one I really, really liked. And with all the compartments and pockets, I knew it was just a perfect size. The thing that I've been looking for for ages, I just didn't want to fork out for the price of the Delphonics bags. I just didn't want to pay out for a bag that was more expensive than my planners. So... I just held off for a while and by chance saw these. So I'm just gonna stand this up and I'll show you how much space there is. Now I did get a big, really, really big bag a few months ago that fits everything in. Now I carry it from my house to the cabin. It's got everything I don't wanna leave in here in that bag. But I wanted something on the go that would fit all my art stuff, my journaling things. So this is a top. And as you would have seen at the beginning, you, uh, it would have given you a really good overall view of the bag. So with the top, with the other picture that I showed you, it has two zips and it is a smaller, slightly smaller bag. This one has one and there is so, so much room in here. So I have all this room plus on the inside a little zip compartment there. I've got my standard size traveller's notebook my B6 Traveller's Notebook and my Kiki K Planner as well. All fit in there and there's plenty more room for say a book if you wanted to have a book in there as well or anything else. So just pop those back in there so you can just see. So I could easily fit a notebook or a, another or a book in, book in there and there's space on top as well. So there's that. Then you have a back compartment here, which for me at the moment is empty. Next you have, which I'll just do it like this, this front flap here, which I've put those pin badges on and I'll obviously add more as I get them. In this front compartment here, this front bit here inside, it has like a stiff board so it protects it and it is it feels it is waterproof this fabric i'm not sure how wet you can get it but obviously if you're running um in the rain uh, or in, not running but you know what i mean walking out or running for, to the bus or whatever um this will stay dry obviously or the contents will anyway so i have my my little pads in there what else do i have and my sticky notes then when you lift this up You've got this compartment here and it fits my tin of watercolours. And these are the Arteza tubes. So it fits all these watercolours in. Now, some people I just mentioned don't like the way that these dry, but if you were to add a little tiny drop of glycerine in, um, I, I've heard that it will I mean, there's nothing wrong with it being drying like this, but if you do put a tiny bit of glycerine in, it will apparently, well, it won't crack anyway. So, but it doesn't bother me, so I didn't really bother doing that. So yeah, it fits a whole tin of watercolours in there perfectly like that. It's like it was made for them. It's amazing. So I have those there. And then you have your side compartments. Now you have two on either side. I have my paintbrushes in the larger one here. And then I have my pens. These are my Micron pens and scissors and there's still room in this one loads of room here you can really fill that out if you wanted to which I pretty much have on the other side I've got here um, my different color pens my standard pens that I use 
Uh, in fact, if I just turn this around, I've got my glue pen here. Just pop in there. I've got my highlighters, pastel highlighters, just all the standard pens and pencils in there. And yeah, that is it really. It's $12.99 from Shoe Zone and I don't know how much longer they'll have them in. I do know they had them on the website. And the strap, I don't think Delphonics has straps, but the strap is adjustable. So I've made it quite short, but you can adjust it so it's really, really long. And again, it's like a waterproof fabric. So yeah, that is my alternative. And I really, really love it because it fits absolutely everything in here. And I just can't get over it, it's only 12 99 So yeah, I've been waiting such a long time to get something like it. And now I have it and I can just carry this around with me. Uh, it's got everything that I need. Yeah, so I'm super happy with it. So my impromptu video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, just pop them below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Take care, bye.